is uh, 424. 424 area code, what's oh, up? Hello. Um, I, I'm Hi. Just generosities and programmations throughout the world. I'm not sure if I'm on the right. Uh, Pat gave me this number to call, and we all got dressed up for this call. And I'm not sure if I'm getting pa- ready. Pat from to, uh, David Packman? Uh, no, I was going to go under the alias of uh, Monsieur Blackman or something, so anoint us too okay. much. Um, there's been rumors that I've been called, and hopefully he, that I've been, uh, there's been <laughs> fallacious activity with me and Patrick. Pat, calm down. Pat, your diary. Off hours. Patrick. <laughs> Anyway, uh, <laughs> if I am talking to such an individual, I'd like to stop getting voicemails and hoarded on my Twitter. Do you know how many people I block every day? Oh, my God. This uh, guy is getting me into a, into a pickle. Um, if you could pass the note amongst his ears. It was his, I, sure. I hear he wears sunglasses. And that you know what scares me the most? His laugh. <clears throat> his laugh scares What's that? me the most. Oh, doesn't it really secretly just sexually arouse you, though? Um, sexual is not in my business. Um, actually, my uh, parents <laughs> cut off my testicles at a very young age, where I'm not under the oh, <laughs> of sexuality. <laughs> you know, it's a tough subject, and uh, uh, oh, we talk about it all the time. Um, you know, eunuch, whatever you would call me, but that's fine. I'm, t- I'm secure in what I'm missing. <laughs> Call me girlfriend. Call You're me... a secure eunuch? Yeah, I am. And that shows. Can we call you the secure eunuch? Yes. It shows transparency. Okay. <laughs> uh, at, at least I'm honest with my viewers. Um, people have called me raunchy, ugly, smelly, that I eat my boogers. I mean, who doesn't eat their boogers? Oh. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, yeah, yeah I, I don't. But, you know, to each his own. I did when I was like six. Right. Oh, me too. I might have eaten your yeah, booger so when it's I was okay. <laughs> but, um, Yeah, I don't know. Did we hang out? I don't think we hung out. I know, but something. Because all out. my friends had testicles. And wherever every party I go to, something hangs out. <laughs> but, okay. uh, oh, that's it. Right. Okay, I got gotcha. you. But I'd like to whoever this H H G, um, he, he keeps talking about me. He was going to give me money, and you know what? It's time for me to show off my democratic. I do not take money from others <laughs> that I don't need it from, okay? $2,000. I'll do it if it's at <clears throat> CNN. I'll do that for sucking free, man. Oh, I said the F word. Anyway, sorry, Pat. Uh, well, that's okay. You're allowed right. to. Um, but I don't need his seckles. I don't need his seeds because I'm Jewish. I said seckles. But that's a bit. Come at me, bro. <laughs> That's my new thing, bro. I'm seeing up hip. Come at me, bro. Yeah, and cool story, bro. That's my new one. Is that old? Or... Anyway, I'm hip. Yeah, that's way old. Right. <coughs> I'm it. I'm it right now. And when I move up, I'm going to look back at you guys. And you know, you're not supposed to punch up. You're supposed to punch down. Um, I mean, yeah, yes. that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> so you wear. I'm gonna wear sunglasses, <laughs> and we're gonna see who's the best sunglasses guy. And I'm gonna be on CNN with my sunglasses, and I'm gonna grease my hair back, and I'm gonna wear track suits, and I'm gonna steal your fucking gig. But I will be next to Don <laughs> and next to Anderson. So come on, man, Pat. You won't be able to curse, though. You're going to have to clean up your act. Oh, I can swear on CNN. Someone's <laughs> called someone a shithole at least 75 times today. Shitholes, I'm familiar with them. George Michael is my favorite. Are artist. you white? Um, Are you white? Because you might not be able to get away with it if you're white. When I only have tan lines. Unless you're Philip Mudd. Right. Oh, okay. Which I'm not having. <laughs> my fucking idol. If he wasn't so black, I'd be cheese. He's like, he's like egg and cheese. Under the table. Reclaiming my time. Reclaiming my time. Oh, Max, Maxine, Maxine gave you the 30-second warning. Okay. Reclaiming my time. Sunglass-wearing monster. <laughs> well, uh, uh, what was your name again? David? 
Oh, he hung up. I think he hung up. Okay. Okay. That is, uh, okay. I have a very important question to my entire viewership. Where the fuck were you guys with this shit? Like, this is like the 10th call-in show. This is what I wanted. That was, remember the first call-in show when the guy called like um, five callers in? I made a video of it. And he was like, oh my God, hard bastard. I have my, my pants down. Like, you remember that guy? That was hilarious. And then it was just all serious. I mean, I don't mind the serious calls. I think they're interesting, but like that is, you can't beat that. All right, so <clears throat> I think that was actually David Pakman. <clears throat> David certainly sounds uh, um, different when he is calling, but um, I hope this is true. President Kamat. Camacho says HB is building his ho own stable of w whack packers. Let's free let's remember these names. What did I say that guy was? He he said uh, he said he was a eunuch, and there was a word that he used. Uh, trans not transparent. Was it transparent? Was he the transparent eunuch? I hope someone in the chat remembers. We have it on video. Confucius, one twenty twelve. That was a jerky boy. That was well done. Like he fucking. That was really well done. What was it? What eunuch? Like the ethical eunuch? No, no. What was it? The transparent eunuch, I think. All right. Well, look. Uh, like I said, I, um, I'm very sorry for who the next caller is because you're going to have to follow that. But that's okay. You can go right back in the other direction and have a serious call. No problem. Three o two. 